Hi, I'm Sandata, yet Villarreal Jr. Welcome to Video Assisted Instruction C++ Programming Series. Our topic for today is about the while controlled counter increment. And uh, I've already created the folder, Lecture 13. It is also the name. And at the same time, it is also the solution name of the program. So we can go now to the source files right here inside the Lecture 13. Right-click, point to add, then click new item. And then under the Visual C++ CPP file, so we need to rename the source.cpp with uh, sandata underscore comprog2 underscore lecture13. Then we can click add. Now we can uh, zoom this to 200 so that you can see the decoding don't forget the lecture from the beginning which is the head the neck and the body sharp include io stream and that is the head so we have the using namespace SCD and in the neck we have integer main and then we have begin and close that is the body now right here on the body we're going to type our code so the programmers code is considered to be uh, integer which is considered to be the data type and we have the variable name okay so this is the declaration I'm sorry this is considered to be the declaration base now this one is the initialization base okay and then let's go to the processing base which is while open and close parentheses so this is the while function or the while statement and of course we're going to put begin and end and we put code inside this begin and end and also in the delimiter open and close parentheses we're going to put here uh, what is so-called relational expression like uh, pambilang is equal less than equals to so remember that we declare that pambilang is considered to be 1 so pambilang will start with 1 rather than 0 so 1 is less than equals to 10 then it can be identified true or false right here at the body of the while statement so we're going to put right here uh, code so we have so this is what do you call the printing on the screen so it will print one okay uh, right here because it is equals to one now let's continue so we have uh, pambilang okay so this is what you called increment go back to the integer main and this is what you called our termination base okay so that is the four paces uh, which we discussed earlier on our previous videos so let's check out debug start without debugging and there it goes okay so we start with one so pambilang is equals to one and it goes to 10 because 
uh, while pambilang 1 is less than 10, continue. Okay? So, this is the increment. N is equals to N plus 1. And N is considered to be uh, pambilang. Okay? That's the idea. That's the idea of this formula. That's the formula of this uh, plus plus pambilang. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you and good luck.